So, Phil, what is it we're going to be making here today? We're making our shredded beef burrito. It's one of our most popular items. It's made with uh, pinto beans, rice, cheese, an authentic tomato sauce, a little bit of... Phil, these are the, the ingredients, all very natural and lovely. What's the next stage? This is a 400-pound buggy, and we actually do about 30 of these bowls every day. Why don't you just go ahead and dump those in there, make sure you get them all in there. I'm going to put this, the rest of this tomato salsa in here. It's our authentic tomato salsa that we make in-house. Yep. Made with organic tomatoes. That is a lot of beans. Phil, is this enough beans for uh, for a taco? Too many beans for a taco. Not so for a burrito, though. I think back to the early days when I was doing this, and I was just kind of tumbling the product with my hands, uh -huh. really simply. And the thing that I like about our process is we're doing the same thing now. We're just doing it in a big way. Now, normally I get my hands dirty. I'm normally involved in, in mixing and doing uh -huh. stuff. and. Uh, there isn't a lot of processing, it's a very simple process, so can I at least press the button, please? Yes, absolutely. Sweet. So go ahead and uh, turn off the alarm there. So, there you go, and, and you can start mixing. Here we go. Oh, it's off. Look at that. There's two sets of paddles in there working, and very quickly you see the mix completely change. You can still see gradations within, it's not like it's 100% totally right. mixed. That's right, that's what we're going for. We really want a crumbly, homemade kind yeah. of feel. Just tell me when to I stop. think you're good. Yeah. I think you're good right it? there, yeah. There we go. Now, this presumably comes out. Into yeah, the, we're going to take it out the shoe right here and yeah. then we'll bring it over to proportioning.